much your girl Melinda here with another haul video Dollar Tree and Dollar General if this is your first time here I want to welcome you to the channel if you like Dollar Tree and Dollar General hauls and shop with me's and browse with me's and and uh, DIYs from these places then this channel is for you I suggest that you subscribe to the channel and make sure you hit the bell so you'll be notified on these uploads now fall is approaching so everything in this haul is crafty because all of these craft shows and fall festivals and things like that are about to kick off next month i have three on the list already that i am looking forward to vending and um how i need to be prepared to be able to do things for other people as well as have enough things for these vending events I'm super duper excited and I can't wait to share with you what I'm going to be doing I can't wait to share with you the items that I picked up and that I found and let's jump into it all right if you like the video please at the end like the video and leave me a comment and tell me what it is that you like I always save my favorite thing for last so stick around to see what my favorite thing is in this haul I'm going to do two favorites, one from Dollar Tree, one from Dollar General, okay? So, I only have just a handful of things from Dollar General, so I'm going to get started with those items first. All right, let's jump into it, y'all. Okay, so the first item we picked up from Dollar General is this decorative twine right here for $1 from Dollar General. It's in the black and white, the little tiny twine. I think it's super, super duper pretty. They have it in several different colors. The orange and white, um, black and orange, black and purple, several different options in the Dollar General. So this is where this comes from for $1. All right. Next from Dollar General, I picked up these two lace dollies right here. It's a two pack. And it's pretty, it's, I guess it's by Perfect Harvest. These were $1. Really, really pretty in the shape of a pumpkin. So stick around and see what I'm going to create with this. Very, very cute. And you get two of these, okay? All right. Next from Dollar General. I found these cutie patootie little picks here. I'm excited to show you. And this one here was $1. You have two pumpkins on here. You have two nice, uh, or is it three? It's two. You got two maple leaves here. I love the color on it. And then you have this little greenery right here. And then another little piece of plastic greenery right here in the back that little piece right here i love it i love the little pick it's just a cute little one little pick but i'm going to take these off and craft with these so i'm not going to like make an arrangement or anything with these these are good, going to be for crafting all right Another floral pick that I picked up that was a dollar at Dollar General is this. You got several maple leaves on here. Several. And I love the color of green that is. And then you have these two little small little tiny berry bunches right here. I will be using these for crafting as well to bring accent to, you know, to embellish the actual item that I am creating. Okay very very pretty i love it all right next we have this one here was a dollar as well and i love this this one caught my eye when i was in there the other day and i said i'm gonna come back and get me some of these and i love this look at the green on that isn't that beautiful that is so so pretty and then i think they call these like cattails or something like that and then you have your little Rafa right here. 
So all of this is going to bring a special touch to something and I am going to craft with these. I'm not going to use these as florals and so I picked up two of these. Now I would love to go back and get some and use for just florals. Okay? So those were a great deal for one dollar. Alright, now from Dollar General, last and certainly not least from there, and this is my favorite item from Dollar General. I picked this up. So cute. It is a pumpkin candy dish for $1. Clear. They didn't have these the other day when I was in there, but when I saw them, I said, oh, look at these. And they had the green and they had the orange. And all I did was pick up one. I only picked up one because I was really going in there for those florals. And I was on a budget saying, Melinda, you're only going to go in here and get four florals, four little dollar picks today. And I ended up, yeah picking this up as well and I ended up getting five florals I believe and that twine so yes really really cute I love it I love it I love it so stay tuned to see what I'm going to do with this I'm pretty sure I'm going to craft with this because it's so cute all right so that's all of the dollar general items now on to the dollar tree items you see lots of wood lots 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 of wood first I'm going to start off with the color I picked up this orange by Acrylogy, Rich Art Acrylogy, and Deep Brown. So I picked up one of each of these. I used this, um, the red oxide, and I loved how it, you know, the pigmentation of it. So I said, well, let me try um, the orange in this Deep Brown. So you will see me use these here on the channel, okay? All right, next up, I picked up some, a little roll of jute twine, because that's the little thin one, and these make the little nice, cute, little tiny bowls, really, really super duper cute, just to add some embellishment to your design. All right, from the Crafter Square, I picked up the Baker's Twine in orange and white. This is like the black and white that I picked up from Dollar General. Really, really pretty. Love, love that. Found these, finally, because they never, ever have them. And this is nine foot, the ribbon buffalo check. Ooh, I can't wait to use it. I have something very, very in store and cute that I want to use this on. So they had two, so I went ahead and got both of those. All right. Next up. I'm going to show you these little picks I got here. This is the maple bouquet. And it had some more of these maple flowers on here. But I already did used some things off of here. It had uh, the little funny shaped pumpkin. I forgot what you call it. But it's like I think it's it maybe like an acorn pumpkin. I'm not sure. More like a different kind of squash it's shaped like a squash but it's really a pumpkin so uh it one with one of those was on there and some more leaves but i already picked off of but i wanted to show you all that all right and then also from there i picked up another maple leaf in this beautiful light tannish color here i love that color all right then i picked up these berries right here they have four berries on here, but I already used one for a design. And I'll make sure that uh, I'll do a little small video on some of the things that I created. Okay, with these things. All right. All righty. Then I picked up this foliage right here. I love working with these because they give great embellishment to your crafts yes so i picked up one of these and also from the florals i picked up this one you got two sunflowers here and you have a pumpkin and you have these little bunches right here and you have some greenery that pretty kind of plastic greenery right there almost like a eucalyptus 
and then you have the green fall green leaves so this is going to be pretty uh, to accent I'm going to use this to embellish because this will be a great embellishment right here all by itself you can put this on something and accent it with that and it's going to be super duper cute so that is the florals all right next what I picked up was I picked up these wood hanging decor right here from the crafter square I picked up two of these so cute stick around to see what I'm going to do with these all right then I picked up I know y'all saw these three pumpkin clips in the Dollar Tree in the different colors this one has come off already but it doesn't matter because I'm not going to use the clip anyway but we're going to work with these so stick around y'all and I love these colors sometimes you don't want everything to be orange you know fall has several different beautiful colors all right okay now these are little tea light candles holders here the wood ones these are super duper cute this is the acorn I picked this up and I picked up the turkey so you got your acorn and you have your turkey I love both of those stick around to see what I do with that I picked up these two uh, craft wood slats here this is the flat ones I picked up two of these great for crafting stick around stick around to see what goes down with that then I picked up this cube I hauled one of these before here on the channel this is gonna be a two-in-one you know you can use this for something else I'm gonna use this by itself so stick around I wanted to see just how well it worked with the other one that I purchased and I'm digging it so yeah you will definitely see what I come up with okay some more wood this right here is a hanging wood sign you can just you know create something on here because you got your rope here to hang but I'm gonna take that rope off pretty sure and do something with this you want to have these little boards because it allows you to build things okay and then I have the chunky slat 8 inch and then I have the 10 inch two of the 10 inch and I know I'm gonna cut those down but this 8 inch is perfect and when when, when you measure the 8 inch to the 10 inch and then you still have that little piece left you take two of those will almost make another one of these so this is going to be a great DIY then this one says just says the craft wood and it doesn't say how long it is but this is just another piece of wood it's not as chunky it's a little thinner that I am going to be using in a craft all right now we have these several cut wood cutouts here you have the acorn I have the turkey I have the leaf and I have two pumpkins okay and then also this one that says happy harvest we're not going to keep this like this we're going to do something else with it it's cute the way it is but we want to make sure it's fancier than this and we'll probably use it hanging or um i'm i just don't know but we will see stick around y'all stick around all righty next we have our all i love working with these the wood stems oh 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 so i picked up two of the little chunky ones these are great stick around to see some cutie things that i'm going to do with those and then i picked up another set of the wood stems and these are just the longer ones great to just top something off Y'all, I got so many cute little craft ideas that I am going to be doing. So stick around. Okay. Off of the, this this is the um, plus aisle. This one was 
three dollars but they marked it down to 125 this is something that you, i can you know jazz up you got your two hooks down here at the bottom i was and then you have something here that you can put stuff on if you want to make it into uh um, for the fall you can sit some of them little pumpkins up there i mean you can really make this be extra cute okay so i picked this up they marked it down okay also off of that aisle plus aisle it was five dollars you see they have the 125 over it and this is a wooden wall organizer and you have your little trays down in here and you have your chalkboard up here i can sit this in the kitchen i do think i'm going to put this in the salon i really do think this is where this is going to go in the salon so that this is so cute and i'm gonna jazz it up and whatever i do you all will definitely see it on the channel all right now I picked up these cute little pumpkins right here. Aren't they the cutest? I love the shape of them. I love it. And I love that it's 3D. That is so, so pretty. It's going to be fantastic. And I picked up three of these. So cute, y'all. So stick around to see what goes down with those. All right, last but not least, my favorite of everything that I picked up in this haul is this cute little leather tags. One says thankful, the other one says blessed. And one, that this one, the leaf, and then you have a pumpkin. I thought that these were the cutest, cutest, cutest. And so this is my favorite thing out of the entire haul. I want to thank you all for stopping by today. Make sure that if you like this video, like it. Tell me what it is that you like about the video. Is there something in here that you want to put on your wish list? Is there something in here that you already picked up? Let me know. Chat it up down there. And also, subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell so you don't miss out on what's coming next. I'm going to catch you all in my next video. Thanks for stopping by.